Recording? All right. So we're going to set up this uh, guillotine from here. A lot of the times this happens uh, when they try to turn on their side, come up to their knees, under hook, where they try to avoid the north-south choke. So just like our setup for the previous north-south choke, I'm going to come up here. He's going to try to do this. And a lot of times, and maybe I can't, once I get here, I can't exactly finish because, you know, he's coming up to his side before I can really anchor it down. That's okay. Now we have our great time to do our north south or our kind of a guillotine from side control. I gotta make sure this is flush under here. Right? I gotta make sure my, my blade of my wrist is on the opposite side of his head. Once I'm there, what I'm gonna do is switch my knee to the inside, grip up. I'm gonna get ready to take mount if I can, or I'm just gonna kinda move this here, pull my knee up, and drop my shoulder. Knee up, elbow to the floor. Raise my hip, just like I'm doing the choke. I gotta get ready for if he tries to pop up and he sits and try to take and try to take me over into my back. So when he takes me over, I pull my elbow up to the sky, finish that Marcelo style guillotine. If you haven't seen the Marcelo style guillotine before, it looks like this. I'm gonna wrap up underneath his head, cut back my wrist, bring my elbow in front of his in front of his body and his shoulder, so that it doesn't matter which direction he goes. I can still finish the choke. So he goes to his, his left, which is the correct side to avoid the guillotine. I still finish the choke. Same idea when we're down on our backs. From here, knee, he comes here to try to come up top. I'm wrapping up, my hip drops, gripping my wrist, bringing my knee in, Dropping my elbow, finishing the choke. If not, he tries to come up, bring our elbow in front, getting our hook, finishing the Marcelo style guillotine. Guillotine from side control.